Hello, Shell from Seashell Massage here. I get asked all the time, uh, what's the best way to sit on the couch when you're watching TV? I have two answers for this. To sit on the floor, stretching, the whole time you're watching TV. Just check the videos uh, that pop up about now. Otherwise, depending on your mobility, if you can't really sit on the floor, it's too uncomfortable, and you sort of have to sit on the couch, the uh, basic and short answer is um, that immobility is the enemy of our muscles. So if you're sitting and watching a few hours a day, just, you know, relaxing back on your couch, uh, curled up on your side, or however it is you sit, um, however you like to do it, if you're there for long periods of time, in any position, it's going to have uh, bad effects on certain muscles. Some different ways that you can sit, uh, you might decide to, every time there's an ad break, change your position, every time you start a new episode, at least, uh, make sure you're changing how you're sitting. Uh, I've got a few different ones for you today, just to help with getting you started. Uh, so firstly, nice and easily, um, best kind of neutral posture you can have is having your, uh, your knees and your ankles all at 90 degrees, sitting back. Uh, making sure you're not slouching, you're not doing these ones. Um, you can grab a pillow, chuck it behind your back, uh, your lower back, which is going to try and help stop that slouch from happening. And it just gives you something more comfortable to lean back on. Next is the figure four stretch that you may have heard of, which is where you're going to pick one leg up and your ankle is going to rest on the opposite knee. It might look like this for you, might look like this, and then you're going to push down with your hand and you can either lean forward in the tense moments of whatever you're watching or uh, just push down and just relax back. Obviously you do both sides. While you're here, you can also chuck both your feet up. Excuse my super noisy couch. It needs to be replaced. Um, yeah, sitting cross-legged for a little while. Um, it's great for opening the hips. If it's not comfortable, um, don't do it. Don't do it so long that your legs go to sleep because you want to keep the circulation happening in the lower legs. And then switching how you cross your leg so that the other leg comes to the front. You can get your leg, um, if you can, if your flexibility uh, allows you to, have one leg bent in, one leg out straight, and then you can, if comfortable, reach towards that ankle and stretch while you're watching the telly. Worst one I see or hear about is people who have arms on the ends of the couch and they have a tendency to sit leaning on one side and they've got one like side of their back shortening, one side lengthening. And then they might also, while they're here, have both their legs up to one side, which is terrible for everything. So you're kind of leaning, all curled up on one side, watching things. And people have favourite sides of the couches to sit on. It's exactly the same either side. Um, so if you do find yourself doing that, either sit on the other side and stretch out the opposite side of your body, or find a better way to sit. Anyway, hope that's helpful guys. Happy watching your telly.